About time for another coach life, baby. Did you know that there is an intelligent force holding every atomic structure together? It's not just a random happenstance force. It's an intelligent force. Electrons doing their dance, protons, neutrons. So at a level that subatomic, we can't we can't see it. There's an intelligent force at work. Perhaps always has been, perhaps always will be. Perhaps even leaves room for perhaps. Yesterday, we were talking about the monarch butterfly making a trip from North America to Mexico, and, and that's the migration, and how amazing that is. It's a butterfly. These wings are thinner than paper, you know. But I, it didn't even dawn on me, because we were talking about the number five. I didn't even re remember to say that that monarch butterfly started off as a caterpillar, large, like goo. Uh, so it had the information it needed to fly to Mexico or North America. Today is April the 1st, it's a new moon. So new month, new moon. Moon is actually the root of month. New month, new moon. Ramadan is, I believe, tomorrow it begins, but the energy is here already. The weather has been windy and everybody got to chill out type of vibes. And so I'm just going to honor that in its fullness. There's a kind of nervous, there's a nervousness right now simply because when the weather tells people to chill out and people are in full-on go mode they try to force it so there's a lot of forceful energy right now but it's the equivalent of uh you know trying to swim against a great wave and it's just good luck so that's the type of vibe today and I'm going to embrace the truth of the matter and let it be. Oh, I got a lesson plans. No, I'm done. I, I just have to convert my lesson plans to the next sections. What else is there? What you got for me? You want to hear something on Coach Life? Let me know. I realize some of this information is inaccessible to everyone so if you want more if you want me to go in more in depth like connecting the dots i realize sometimes i don't connect all the dots because well the real reason why i don't connect the dots all the time is because certain people don't need this information just yet they wouldn't know what to do with it if anything they would you know mishandle it and so i, I would feel bad given a 17 year old a Ducati, you know? Um, you gotta start with the small bikes. You gotta start, you gotta start where you are and then understand the, the, the brilliance of this engineering and then understand the, the responsibility of it. So that's why I leave some space so it can just be, you know, for those, of, for those of us who are, who are, I hate to say who have done the work, but for those of us who are sensitive enough to understand energy, it's there. And then for, for those of us who are doing the work, then it's it's something to work with. So that's, that's kind of how I frame the coach lives. If you go back 2017, when I was in New York, and when I first started doing the coach life videos, I actually started with the universal launch kit and past, present, future, 
in the, in the intro. So it was a four part video clip, very short. If you go back to those, you'll understand everything I'm talking about right now. So uh, it was really like a organic buildup. I didn't even know, but this is where we are. So yeah, if you need to connect more dots, let me know. But again, I would go back to those 2017 vids or um, yeah, just, just holler at me and we can talk. Because these are times where people who are sensitive to energy really need to connect and share space. Um, it's, I mean, it's really always time, but <laughs> when you have energy such as this around, it's really time. So it would be more timely. Oh, see what we did there, you know? Did you know that time and space is actually a fabric? Did you know that? We're so used to separating time and space. But when we need to get something done, we know that we need to connect time and space. I don't tell you just to meet me at Starbucks. Shout out to NDT. This is uh, definitely riff from that. Star Talk. If you never watched it, it's a great informative. But anyways, I don't just tell you to meet me at Starbucks. I'll tell you meet me at Starbucks at six o'clock. Time and space is a fabric. Anywho, that's the coach left for today. I hope you have a good one. I'm gonna go set up my classroom and gear up for it i have a feeling the sun will push a lot of this fog out which makes me kind of sad because I, I like the fog i like uh this reminds me of nana and bear paw. oh i had the coolest bear paw dream last night oh david and saskia was in it i was like real quick i got to i think david and saskia were speaking and then we were at this kind of event space, but the, the the chairs were arranged weird and people couldn't see. And it was just like the arrangement of the space was strange. And uh, people asked to move things around, but it, it just seemed like it was a too big of an undertaking for people. And I was just like, what? I just got up and I just moved the chairs around the tables and I put bear paw and I think it was Uncle Butch. I put them right in front so they could see David and Saskia and every and David and Saskia and the Bear Paw Uncle Butch were like, like, yeah, yeah, like you, you just you fixed the space for us. Like and it, it was like that was my job. I felt like my nobody told me to do it and I, I actually it felt like I wasn't supposed to given the like the people who ran the space, but when I did it, it everyone was like, Yeah. Now we now we rocking. So that was really cool. Another dream with black sweatshorts that were really comfortable. And a cafe. Anywho, you don't want to hear about my dreams. Coach life. Today, take it nice and easy. You know, don't swim against the waves. Just understand what you bring when you when you walk into that room. Bring your whole self. And let that let that magic flow. All right, coach life.